All right. <clears throat> I am back. Took a while, but I am back. I see you gather before me. But finding me proved no simple task. For having fallen afoul of Novograd's underworld buses, I'd disappeared. Yet Geralt soon discovered my whereabouts, a cell in the dungeon of the Temple Guard. With the help of our friends, Geralt managed to free me. Good thing, too. For indeed, I knew what had happened to Ciri. Sadly, she was no longer in Novograd. Pursued by bandits, then cornered by the temple guard, she had disappeared in a flash of light and a gust of heat. Where to? This I did not know. So, yeah, I've been sick for the last week. <clears throat> so you may hear some coughing during the streaming. Um, I'm a lot better than I was. At least I can carry a conversation without going into a coughing fit. So, yeah. But, <clears throat> I am back. And I hope to make some progress in this game. Uh, <clears throat> and I know, like, a lot of people, when they don't see... Um, they don't see people streaming for a while, um, like a while, a week. Um, they change their allegiances. So, yeah. I don't really remember where I am. I'll be honest with you. Oh! Which apparently, yeah. <clears throat> So apparently, Stop it. I need to, in order to go to Northgard, is oh, my wish. Uh, <laughs> if I remember correctly, I have. Hey, real life, how's it going? I am back into the streaming of things. Ram, ram, time again. I'll kill for some vodka. Um, yeah. Um, I had bronchitis. So, King of. Merchant. Really? Apparently, I need a, th a thousand shillings or whatever currency I have. Um, so that means I need to go to a merchant and I need to sell a shit ton of shit. Can I just take a boat to where I need to go? Because uh, technically, I don't know if I could do that, but. We will see if we can. <clears throat> like, where is Skilliga, though? Like... <clears throat> this is... I can't do. Find a boat instead of to Skilliga. So I have to speak to a captain. I thought there was a captain here. No, no, no fall. No. I'm busy. You call this living, Witcher? Where's the cap? Oh, oh, Copkin. <clears throat> you captain of this tub? What's it to you? I'm Skellige bound. Need to get there. Start swimming. Islanders, the black ones, all attackers in those waters. No one sails the route these days. Come on. Clans are ready to deal. Leave you alone if you do. 
Someone's done it. Gotta have. Not likely. Except maybe that daft bastard Wolverstone from the Atropos. A liar, a thief, and a bugger, that one. He might have parlayed with the sea swine. Hmm. Where can I find him? In a pigsty most times. Others, the Golden Sturgeon. As for Flask, everyone knows him. Overrider, thank you for the host. Great Champino, Psychosis, Angry Gorilla. Uh, Mr. Garf, 1988. Thank you for the hosts. You guys rock. So now I have to go that way. <clears throat> and it's probably gonna tell. They're probably gonna tell me that I need to fucking get like 10,000 million freaking coins and currency. Uh. <clears throat> oh boy. All right. Uh, oh, he's in here. the guy I need to speak to. <coughs> oh. Let's talk to this guy. You, Wolverston, captain of the Atropos? So you want to know if I'm Atropos, captain of the Wolverston? No fucking clue, mate. I need to get to Skellige. My Atropos and me, we're due to sail for our Skellige. Carrying grain. But that's our shush. Got any coin? Can I get some? Gotta get more coin. You sure do. For I won't even whip me horse in a bath without payment in advance. Alright. <clears throat> so, let's go. So. There's a merchant here. Shopkeeper, shopkeeper, shopkeeper. Now, where can I go get my. <coughs> oh, there we go. So I can go get a stash. So let's go here and see how that goes. And we'll take it from there. Alright, um. <laughs> Shopkeep right here. Apparently. <clears throat> well, well, look who's here. The white wolf himself in my humble establishment. How can I be of service? I, I need a loan. I'd like to convert some currency. Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. A better rate you'll not find anywhere in the city. Pay Captain Wolverstone, you quest him out. <coughs> okay. What do I have in terms of my inventory? Not too much, actually. But this can go for a pretty penny. Um, I don't have the coins anymore, though. I think I stored them. Uh, yeah, I stored them. Shit. Okay. Let's go to where is the closest freaking um, oh right there. 
Look at that. Why don't you look at that? Oh, geez. It's right there. Uh, let's go here. Go for some traveling. So I hope uh, you guys have been going well. Um, I know I haven't haven't really been uh, streaming much lately. Um, I have been following you guys. At, you know, real life dinosaur psychosis. Um, Mr. Garf, I actually haven't. Um, gone in a while actually but he is completely opposite of my schedule so got the coins. Ah, now I have to find a shop that I can sell these at. Shopkeeper here. So let's try that. That sounds very nice. Nothing like hearing some hot spit. Where the fuck am I going? I'm going completely opposite of where I'm supposed to go. I was following the wrong arrow. Damn me. Uh, fun times. Watch it, cry it. Oh, go crikey. Go crikey yourself. Um, Alright, I'm getting close. I'm getting close. I'm getting close. Um, where is he? Got my eye on you. Oh, he's right there. Um, what village are you from? Willows. It's into the area two days long from the Zima. You're the only one here to make a mistake. Now step out some crap. Someone else, what? <laughs> I'm knackered. Ah! You. Leave him alone. And who might you be? Temple guard undercover? Try concerned citizen. Call me an admirer of law and order. Made a mistake coming to this town, then. You're making the mistake. Leave him alone. And if we don't? <clears throat> This man's not worth your efforts. His shop's drowning in debt. You're right. Even looks like a pauper. I beg to differ. Don't even know why I bothered the bugger. My apologies, and fare thee well. I, uh, gotta go brush my teeth. <laughs> don't wash your face, though. But don't wash your face. Go home, merchant. And try not to come around here anymore. I will. I, I mean, I won't. I, I mean, both, yes. Thank you, sir. <sighs> so, this was a red herring. Okay. Well, that... <coughs> that didn't lead me to anywhere. Well, that sucks. Okay. 
Let's go to this one then. This time I'm going to try and follow my actual arrow. Boom, 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 ba doo, boobity, boobity, boo. Beebity, boobity, 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 boobity. Hard times we live in. Open up. All right, let's see if this guy has any money. Mm -hmm. What are you offering? Back to the guy. Fuck went. See you. Um, all right, let's go back. Uh, where is the door? Why do I keep hitting beside the door? Anyways, okay. Uh, I have to go that way now. Um, Concerned Citizen Sermon. <coughs> Remember, dear people, that a fire once lit cannot be stopped. That is, consumes everything in its path and only ceases to rage once all has been turned to ash. Men cannot flee this element, and if they bow before it, if they let it into their hearts... They too turn to ash. Search then your conscious consciences and live in accordance with the church's dictates before the time for penance has passed, concerned citizen. Okay. I feel enlightened. Um, I guess I should go that way then. Well, that sounds disgusting. That's just flat out disgusting. Yeah, like right. uh, 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 Alright. Getting closer. Hopefully I can get to a boat soon. Uh, other way. Ayo Silva. Let's go to the Batmobile. Uh, first, from the strength of the wind to good fortune and to the strength of my atropos. Uh, anchors away. Oh, wow. That looks good. something I'm pretty sure impossible I go this unscathed <coughs> rock a bye baby on the treetop humans don't trust non-humans racial tensions in cities where they cohabit often explode in 
pogroms and blah blah blah. anymore bring it on cough a bit. Damn me and my coughs. Oh man. Oh. Skellige. Well that was a smooth landing. Not a fear to die. You of clan on crate? Rob quartz as much. See, I've landed on Ord Skellig. How you figure that? You're wearing clan on crate colors. Ord Skellig's their island. On the Atropos, were you? Yeah. Thought the captain had a deal with you. With us? Meaning who exactly? Might have arranged something with Lugos, but crack. Nay. Clearly should have, though. Outlander ships aren't welcome in these waters. What about you? What do you seek in Skellige, eh? Agreed to meet a sorceress here. Yennefer of Vengerberg. She's supposed to be on Ord Skellig. There's a witch at Kertrolda. Croc's guest. Could be the one you're meeting. Don't like her? That scorn I hear in your voice. You've good ears. Folks say this witch got crack wrapped around her finger. Orders everyone about. Word is she's vicious at it. But a hag's a hag. What crutches guess good look like? Seen her? Know what the sorceress looks like? Aye. Where's black and white? If not for her tits, you'd think she was a beached orca. Fact is, even those who see her for a wench and gladly push her out to sea, tits and all. Sorceress can't be like that. Yennefer's not all bad, once you get to know her. <laughs> Take your word for it. Know the way to Kertrolda? Expect I'll find it. Head north. Then turn west towards the bay before you come to the bridge. You'll find the Jarl port site today. Your sorceress ought to be there too. Thanks. So long. save. <clears throat> Haven't done that in a while. My, my, uh, <coughs> my trusty companion made it. Here. Oh. Nice. Well, 
Wow, there's a lot of good things here. Ah, uh, that stench. That was good. Let's read that sirens. Sirens, out at sea. <coughs> if you hear a beautiful woman singing, turn the ship around at once. You understand? Even if it means sailing straight back into a storm. A Reich of Hindernjigal. Advice given to a son before his first solo voyage. Like skilled hunters setting out wooden ducks to lure in drakes, sirens, and lamias, lure men near, using their own bodies as decoys. They can transform to resemble beautiful human maidens, though with tails covered in silver scales instead of legs. Once a naive sailor gets within arm's reach of these beautiful creatures, their fair faces suddenly turn to fang-filled, fish-like maws, and lovely tails, promising unknown delights, become sharp, death-dealing talons. Okay, well, let's go looting. Oh, treasure. Nice, nice. Hey, I'm not going to say no to that. Alright. Oh, there's a... Ah, there's a... on top of that. <coughs> I'm starting to get full. Starting to get full. Really? Right. Meet the nest right then. Gotta ruin it for them. For one Oh, 20. Nice. Alright. Alright, that was nice. Uh, let us go... I forgot my buttons, apparently. Alright. Um. Wow. Nice find. Very nice find. Oh, place of power. <coughs> place of power. All right, I want a building point.
So let's put that somewhere useful. Um, see what the hell vitality 200 points okay I understand I do not know what to expect, to be honest. Go, go. Um, go to the port near your throat. Quest. Nidus near Collapse Bridge and north of Einhorn. I don't know where that is. Like, I should be able to finish this, but I don't know where the fuck it is. And the game is not giving me a lot of hints on exactly where it is. And I don't want to look it up online, so. Fuck you. Yeah, I don't want to fucking do that shit. Uh, I could do this one. Search for forest. Search the forest. Oh, this is in Velen. Huh. Let's go. Could have actually done that in Velen. Oh, yeah. crossroads. Nice. Where am I? Oh, there's a thing here. Let's go see. Yeah, because tall grass apparently is is, a, is an issue. Uh, maybe I didn't move it. Buffer. Where am I supposed to go? Okay, so let's go there. So I would assume once I go here. Let's go. All right. <coughs> Reading material. Nice. Uh, let's go check. Glory to Eldred. The, <coughs> the Council of Elders has decreed that the for spotting the pirates who in the dead of night were trying to sneak upon the village and for chasing them back to their boats with a hot iron, fire iron in her hand. Eldred the Brave is to be rewarded ten sheepskins and a barrel of finest med. The Patroci Patricide's Execution Otar the Bold was pronounced guilty of murdering his own father by the Council of Elders. He will be punished as the laws demand for such a crime. He will be burnt with fire, then flayed, then sewn in a sack together with a cat, a dog, and a snake. And finally, the sack will be thrown into the sea. The Council of Elders' Decision The Council of Elders decrees that it is unbecoming that Renvig's sons and daughters should wear foreign clothes, 
Whoever notices a woman wearing continental lace, satin, or silk can tear them off her and the two pieces. Then and there. Similarly, if a warrior starts dressing up in useless glittery armor or boots with golden buckles, he will be severely punished. Disturbing port portents. The druids have seen disturbing portents in the guts of a sacrificial lamb. If you don't have to, don't go out to sea for next week and do not sign any contracts. Nothing. I'm asking for help from any who can give it. Someone has cast a cruel and treacherous curse on my line for which I cannot find a remedy. If your skill is in undoing such charms, or even if you have heard of a worthy cunning man or peller uh, who, can, who has such a gift, seek me out in my house near Renovig and rescue me from this misfortune. I shan't spare the coin in recompense, Lotar. Alright. Contract, missing son. Be ye Skilliger or continent man. Read attentively and to the very end. My son, Olv, he went off to seek adventure and never returned. So I'm asking all travelers to keep their eyes out for him. And if you bring him, hap bring him back or find out what's happened to him, I'll pay a generous reward and keep you in my prayers to Freya, Odin of Rendevig. Alright. That's fair. Uh, let's see. <coughs> These quests. Oh, okay. It's only a 14. That's not too bad. And what was the other one? This is Novigrad, 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 Novigrad. Uh, Novigrad, Velen. Velen, 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 Novigrad, 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 Novigrad. Skilliga. Skilliga. Okay, that's too much. That's too much. <coughs> Alright. So I guess the only one I can actually do is technically this one. Alright. Roach. Let's go talk to Roach. Let's go to, I recognize your type a mile away. Get up. Oh, he's right there. Well, that was far. You, Odin? I am. Hear about me, Sonny? Where should I search for your son? Where should I look for your son? East of here. Midst the ruins of the fortress. He went there with some rogues from Pharaoh. Met him at the tavern. They filled his head with nonsense about some treasure. I said, Sonny, Pharaoh folk are liars to a man. You shouldn't fraternize with them. But he knew better. How'll I recognize him? All I know is he doesn't listen to his father. Pretty typical for his age. His name's Olve. A cheerful lad. A bit of a lisp. Nothing special about his looks. Except last I saw him, he was wearing a yellow <coughs> tunic. Lovely. None other like it in the village. Got it from me a year back. On his birthday. That ought to do it. I'll look around. No promises, though. Like... Interrupt. 
Nay, my prayers are in vain anyways. Heard you're having trouble with a curse. Here you're having trouble with a curse. Aye, I am. Look, see it lying there. The horse head on the pole. That's... A nothing. Kind of curse. Seen this before. They're nothing to scoff at. Can bring misfortune, even death. Aye, and the name carved upon it is Tialva. My firstborn. Boy's feverish. Grows weaker by the day. I fear I'll bury him before the next moon. I tried to lift the curse myself, but... No luck. I can help you. I can help you. One of two ways. First, I can try to convince whoever put up the nithing to lift the curse themselves. Second, I can deflect the curse back on whoever cast it by writing their name on the shaft. Either way, need to know who's behind this. But I don't trouble no one. Don't know a soul who'd wish it upon me. Mm-hmm. Guess I gotta investigate. Choose your ladder for the ice giant. A nithing. A powerful curse. Name carved on the shaft. Tialva, son of Lothar. Trails fresh. Hmm. Might want to look around some. You think? It's clearing up. Thank you. Johnny Weatherman? Okay. That's a weird pattern to take. Alright. Whoever just joined, hello. Hope that you're having a wonderful evening. I, uh, first time I've been streaming in quite a while, so. Back to where I started. I think I did. Ah, poops. Let's do this again. They went here. Then they went here. Went here. progress. Too many scents. Can't follow my nose any further. Need to ask around about the shawl. Newcomer. Yes, indeed. Sounds that she wanted to get a lead. Well then. Okay. Well, that's not where I'm supposed to go.
Good night, people. Uh, although, ask about the shawl's owner. This guy's supposed to tell me. He's the only one I haven't spoken to. Like, seriously. I have a feeling I'm going to get shellacked over here. No such thing as bad ships oh. or bad weather. Only worthless fucking You'd better not. Mine needs worries like a boat needs... Uh, <coughs> Sorry about that. Um... That's a house, and this is way out of circle, so. Eye on you. That sounded like a very depressed Eeyore. Okay, so I have to do apparently something around this area. Oh, I have a feeling that I'm supposed to ask this guy, but it's not working. Speedy Oswald, they call me. Remember last year? Because I'm quick. Okay, probably this is going to be a racing thing. <coughs> All right. Speak to me, kind sir. I know that if I do anything to him, hey, lead our ways, Drifter. Yeah, let's load again. As Yennefer of Bengerberg told it, there had been a massive explosion in Skellige. Related to Ciri's reappearance, it had destroyed a vast swath of forest. Geralt set out for the Isles to join the sorcerers and seek further clues of Ciri's whereabouts. Fun times. All right, so. So, okay, so he's standing in front of here. So maybe you're a witcher, right? Yes. Hey there. Hey, Mr. DJ, put a record on my gun. You're a witcher, right? Yep. I do not know what to do. Engineering Gaming Nerd, thank you for the host. Greatly appreciated. Um, where the freak? 
I am Talkard. Good for you. I don't actually know. Ask about the shawl's owner. Newcomer. Greetings. There's literally no one I haven't asked any questions about. Okay. Maybe if I wait, wait till the morning. Of those nice feral lads who were treasure hunting in the ruins. I don't know. I'm working, but I'm afraid we shan't see him again. Oof. Why are you talking like that? More time I'm down the to the to do my rush. Build your Ah, oh, finalement. Finally. Greetings. Greetings. Herbs. Got any to offer? Mind if I have a look at your herbs? That's a nice pickup line. Actually, nothing I wanted because I don't do alchemy very well. See you. Fare thee well. So I didn't realize. Okay. I still can't talk to this guy. You're a witcher, aren't you? Is it me or there's a bug here? Is that? This here's an ambulance. Not them here for you. Not them here for you. Aye. Well, well. That was hurt. I don't know what you Aye. What did you need? You recognize a shawl? Any chance you know who wore this shawl? Of course. Yona, our herbalist. Lives there, in that hut. Oh, she'll be pleased you found it for her. I was literally... Yeah, real pleased. I was there, like, literally three seconds the sorceress. ago. sorceress. Yennefer, right? Not too many... Wow. I couldn't just... Ah, oh, boy. Found your shawl near Lothar's house by the knithing you put up there. How did you know? Had a hunch. Thanks for confirming it. You know Tjalv has got one foot in the grave. Good. That bastard should never have been born. Me, I was to be Lothar's bride. But he cast me aside for that flounder. Getting his comeuppance now. Him and that whole plowing family. You'd kill a child out of jealousy? You'd kill a child out of jealousy? Are you serious? It is not jealousy, but dignity that matters here. Ten years we lived side by side. Ten years. I cooked for him, washed his breeches, shared my bed. And he abandoned me with nary a word. The whole village laughed. Stupid bent Yona let herself be had. Oh no, I've not been had. Nor have I forgot. I want you to lift the curse. I want you to lift the curse. I mean it. Fine, I'll do it. But I've my terms. Lothar's to renounce his son and come back to me. I'll be sure to tell him. But I think we both know what his answer will be. Alright. Need more time in the aisles. Build your Let's go back. You know who placed the knifing? Your old friend, Yona. Old friend of yours, Yona. <sighs> Might have guessed. Jealous bitch! Can't stand to see others happy. So, will she lift the curse? Yeah, sure. All you gotta do is renounce your family and go back to her. Nay. Never! My wife, my son, I'd strip them of honor. <coughs> Condemn them to poverty. You've got to break the spell, Witcher. Let her die!
You might deserve to be punished, but not this way. Fine, I'll do it. Thanks be to the gods. Don't bring the gods into it. This is between two human beings. J-O-N-N-A. May it be quick and painless. Alright, that was easy. <coughs> so? Did it work? It did. Your son should recover soon. And Yona will die. Thanks, Witcher. A thousand times over. My son's dearest of all to me. I couldn't abide it if he died. Your reward. Will you eat with us before moving onward? No. Not in the mood. At least he was nice about it, though. How much did this bring me? Fucking one. One point. One experience point. Really? Really? Not that it was a hard one, but at least a hundred would have been nice. Ugh, what a crock of shit. Alright, what's the other quests? Um... This one, I don't know where it is. Following the thread, multiple locations, suggest a level one. Go to Pharaoh and look for Hammond. Okay. Let's look at this. Well, there's a few places that I haven't gone. Let's go there. Okay, let's save before. Because, uh... I'm gonna get shellacked. And all those question marks are always a problem. And I do not know the monsters that exist here. So. That's a bandit camp. Wait, no bandits? a little deceiving. Uh, let me press on have my horse come and I will hump him. Thank you. Let us save the game. And let us look at the map. Um, well, might as well go here. Move it. Not so fast, Roach. Nice pooch. Nice pooch. What's this offer? Got a contract for me? Might do. If you're willing to partner with me. Usually work alone. Could pay to make an exception this time. It's not every day you get a chance to work with the most renowned bounty hunter north of the Yaruga, Jenga Fred himself. What do you need me for? I'll bite. What's the famous Jenga Fred need a witcher for? I'm guessing you're a man of the world. Perhaps you've come across the Grossbart brothers in your travels. You hunting them? Aye, quite the rogues they are. 
three of them. And everyone's got a pack of rapes and murders under his belt. He even took to grave robbing lately. Easy to recognize on account of the yellow caps they wear. Folks see three yellow tops, they flee to their huts. Which don't help much, of course, because they're also fond of arson. No, haven't met him. If you do, tread careful. They're quick to stick a knife in a man's gut. Often just by way of greeting. Doubt they'd try that with a witcher. You never know with that lot. Right, well I head south soon. Haven't looked there yet. Fare you well. We might meet again someday. A witcher? Look for Grossman Brothers and Arts Kelly. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that. At least not just now. Yeah, level 26, I can't fucking do that. All right, let's read. <coughs> Council of the Elders' decision. The Council of Elders has decided as follows. If one rents a mare and a mare foils, foals, the foal is the owner's property. But the one to whom the stallion belongs has the right to half a pail of milk for as long as the mare is producing milk. About Jordis. Many a young man has asked me to give them my Jordis as wife. Real Life Dinosaur, thank you for the host. Um, to all of them I say the same thing. Jordis will take the one she herself chooses, and I will not go against her wishes. Go talk to her, and if you like, if you like, and leave me in peace. Likir. Go plow somewhere else. To the couple buffing in the barn every night, write the crupper somewhere else. I've had enough of the noise. Next time, I'll chase you out with a whip. And maybe they'll actually like it. Looking to buy a ram's head. <coughs> Anyone selling a ram's head? Need one for my eel bait. An omen, perhaps? I caught the two-headed cod yesterday. Is it a sign from the gods? For I don't know whether to start it... Start it smoking or take it to the druids so that they can have a look at it. Pally. Need a man. Well, I think I am. Looking to take in a handsome, unmarried man to keep me warm at night. He must be fair-haired, well-proportioned, with a thick beard. That's what she said. Fresh breath and considerable lustiness. Justrid. Okay. Oh, that didn't last too long. Alright. What else is there? That was a waste of time. Hey, what's here? Come on. Really? We go all the fucking around? Really? Standing right on top of it, aren't I? Guarded treasure. Okay. And it's down. Down where? Here? Where is this thing? should be something that's fucking huge and I can't move it.
<clears throat> sure. Uh, let's go for inventory. See what we've got. Sure. expect it to be uh, that much better but I'm good for that <clears throat> let's save <coughs> where's my eating grass again I told you to stop eating grass bro I told you. Um, uh, yeah, I saved. Yeah, so I need to go. Let's go traveling a bit. Uh, let's go around the coast. Actually, you know what? Let's start here. And I'm going to go all around here. There's a lot of different places where I can get some some good things, so yeah, I'm gonna do that. Come on, Roach. Probably gonna get demolished on some places, but hey, hey, who cares? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Run, Roach. Run, run of the wind, Roach. Run. Run like the wind, run like the wind to be, to be free again. Come on. This looks like an abandoned area. There's a bear that's dead. So that means that whoever protecting the treasure is yeah So is there actually anything here? It was just, just... Really? There was nothing else here? Nothing. to be something here as well, other than mushrooms. Oh. <coughs> Old 
yellow letter. Gianni, as I write these words, you are six years old. I am 30. I am in my prime, but I know already I'll never teach you how to shoot a bow, nor how to ride a horse or care for a sword. I'll never take you on a raid, or nor out fishing. I took a wound to my knee during the last raid. It's taken a turn for the worst. It shouldn't have taken more than a few days to heal over, but something got in the blood. Wounds not full of pus stinks. I'm losing feeling, and the, the druids say it's beyond their help and that I'll bleed to death if they cut my off my leg. So I'm preparing for death. You're in for, for some tough years, lad. Our family's got a great many enemies. I've defended you against them, but now you'll be on your own. Perhaps someone will help you, and perhaps not. That's why I've had part of our goods hidden, in old Yule's house, under the floorboards. That way, no one can take it from you. No one can steal it and you can dig it up once you're all grown. I've asked your mother to give you this letter when you start your 18th spring. You take that silver. Um, okay, what, how old is he? I'm losing feeling, blah, 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 so I'm preparing my death. Oh, that's at the bottom. Six years old, I mean another 12 years. Um, and you can dig it up once you're on your own. Mother will give you this letter. You take that silver, son. Buy yourself a fine blade, some armor, a horse, raid the continent, exact revenge on the men who did you wrong after my death. Make me proud. I never told you this, but I've always felt it. I love you, Yanni. I hope one day we'll meet in the halls of Freya's eternal green garden, and you'll tell me about your life, the life I was not able to see. You have my blessings, son. Find the treasure chest using your witcher senses. Okie dokie. to the next map uh, yeah so that was the first one this is the second one I think I have to go over mountains which is not good usually. yeah I have to go over that shit I don't know how the hell I'm gonna do that but we'll find a way Run, Roach. Go, go. able to go over. Well, at least I think so anyways. Well, at least it makes sense that I'm sliding. Um, hmm. Any way to get around? That 
с нее. Okay, so I can't actually defeat these guys. Shit. Fuck. That was too greedy. <laughs> I don't know if I saved it last time. Oh well. Hope that everyone is having a wonderful evening. Sorry, I'm kind of losing my voice now. Uh... And I missed one of my favorite nights to stream, which was Sunday, which is Retro Night in Canada. However, this week I did review Bases Loaded on the NES. Awesome, awesome game. If you want to read that, you can go to uh, corporategamer.net. Uh, did I go? Did I? Yeah, okay, so I did this. If I'm gonna be able to string, okay, I'll go for string. Beautiful scenery, though. Freaking awesome. Uh, next, I wanted to go here, but I have to cross. I have to cross the freaking ice capades. At least in this game, there's snow. In Fallout, you, you in Fallout 4, you go in Boston. And you're playing in Boston. There's no snow. No matter when. Okay, you can blame it on radiation, but still. was fun. Where am I? Ooh, I made it. <coughs> oh, and there's a thing right there. Quest available right there. Well, let's go for the quest. Fuck that. Look at us, Sato. Get him, lads. What the hell? Okay. Sure. Whatever tick tickles your fancy, bro. This drawing board. Um, where am I going now? Uh, here. So I am going here. So technically, my trusty steed. There we go. Give me up. Oh, 
come on. scared and he's here all right let's go back find who the fuck the captain was. Find a key. Nice soundtrack. I really like the song. It's very somber, but it's very nice. Right, let's, uh... Um... God bless and reward you, Witcher. Though I can give you only a modest gift. Come by me home. It's not far. Okay. Let's take this horse and let's go to the next destination. Uh, that's probably where the herbalist is. All right, let's go here. That's it, Roach. Shall I find there? Ooh, oh. to repair my sword. Uh, I need a silver sword. Why the hell did I take it off? Where was my silver sword? 
Oh, there. There we go. <coughs> All right, and apparently the treasure is here. Ignorant merchant's notes. Praise to be to Freya, our great mother. They said the road was fraught with danger, that sea devils awaited any who traveled it, that a bandit lurked behind every tree. But I sacrificed a lamb to Freya, and donned an amulet made of falcon feathers, and lo and behold, I tra traversed the entire isle without so much as a drawing my sword. I did some damned fine trading along the way, packed my checks, chest so full of silver and other treasures that my back near snapped setting in in the wagon. If everything goes as planned, I'll be home by tomorrow, around sunset. I owe the goodness mightily for the tender care she's taken of me. Okay. Find the treasure chest using your Witcher senses. Okay. I think it's in the water. And in the water. Well, at least I killed most of the... Um... Oh, there she is. And let's dive. Wow. Did I get any experience for that? Nope, I did not. Ah, oh, boy. Alright, well, next on the world map. I've done that. Let's go here then. Roach. Let's go to the Batmobile. Move it. One ability point. Boop, boop. All right. <coughs> Increase a strong attack critical hit by 2% and strong attack critical hit damage by...
Nice. Next one on the list. Boom. Let's save. Faster. This way, right? Yeah. I want to at least make myself try at least to get myself to level 22. At least I'm getting some points for something. None of them here. How much is one worth? Two fucking experience points. Really? Like, seriously? Wow. Okay. If you say so. I kind of have to grind in this game, unfortunately. Uh, guarded treasure means I have to save. Let's not go for that right now. But we can go for this. Oh, no. Uh, we can go for this. Hopefully, it'll be easier. And it seems like this would be a bandit camp. More than anything else. It's kind of. Uh, 
no other way to getting down there. Oh, if you want to do it that way. Merchant once told me I reminded him of an arena. Naturally, I immediately teleported him to one of their nests so he could see for himself how ill fitting a comparison it was. Lita Nade, the sorceress also known as Coral. Hard it is to imagine, the arenas found in Skilliga are even more repulsive and dangerous than harpies. They're close relatives. Though well rotten carrion is their food of choice, they will not turn up their noises at fresh meat. Man flesh included. Right, so R is the Actually you should save this. Uh... Alright. And who is up there? Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah. Fuck. Going to that again. All right, at the end of this road, there is something that's there. I'm assuming it's a monster, but I'm not too sure. Or a bandit camp. I'm making progress. Not much, but I'm making progress. Uh, <coughs> sure. Alright. 
So that's that for that. Uh, what the fuck is this? Let's go there. Can't jump over a barrel though. Move it. Gloves are worth nothing. These boots, uh, they're not really weighing much. This I don't give a shit. Let's drop it. Alright, so I did quite a few things. So, yeah, let me get my horse. And we shall he head over to the hills. the direction where I need to go. Let's see. I can go this way. There's no way of getting up. Alright. Okay, seriously. I'm on the fucking road. Why am I slipping? Hey yeah. Seriously. see if we can get to the top of this. Highly doubt it, but... Actually, you know what? Uh, save. Slip and slide. There's things over there, though. I'm hoping that I can get from get to there from over here. If I'm gonna slide, that's gonna be fucking painful. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I'm gonna be cutting it close, aren't I? Yeah, of course. I was grabbing, but all right. Okay, there's no way I can get in here. And 
this was just... No, 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 no. All right, so there's a, th there's a thing around. So let's go around. Let's see if I can make it. Make it the last probable. Uh, Show me what you got. Show me what you got, what you really, really got. Just show me what you got, what you really, really got. You gotta... Okay. You're dead, bro. slip please don't slip I fucking beg you no no come on I can get to the top I can see it we're fucking cleats That sucks, balls. But there's a den around here. Yostiana's Grotto. Gotta do some shrooms, bro. Placed an illusion here. Ventured a bit too far, white-haired stray. But you still got a chance to leave here alive, if you pay. Uh, I'd like to leave, not to pay. Fine, I'll leave. Not about to pay anyone for the privilege, though. Of course, we're not bloody traitors. Not gonna haggle. So that was pointless. Completely pointless. Uh, and I ended up all the way over here. I was supposed to go in over here. And there's another fucking thing over here. Ah. Well, 
Well, let's go over here. See what I can find. scenery though. I really like the snow. the gods. My son Newt <coughs> returned from <coughs> sorry about that. My son Newt returned from the raid. Though everyone said he died a hero's death in Nilfgaard, I prayed day and night for him to my prayers got answered. He returned. I thank the gods and will neither eat nor drink for two weeks. Marmor. Okay. Scott Guard's nickname. Yesterday, young Scott Guard shot a doe from a hundred feet away with such force that the arrow buried in the doe's brisket up the fletching, fleshing, fletching, yeah, and killed her on the spot. For this extraordinary achievement, the Council of Elders have decided to bestow upon his nickname, Red Arrow. Death of Erica. My wife Erica died in childbirth, childbirth yesterday. The child is alive. She was a good, strong wife. May all in Firistol remember her name. Bruzi. Wedding. This Sunday, Ignis Hulgerson will plight her troth to Igmar Bergman. All who wish the young couple well say a kind word to them or bring a wedding gift. Whaling expedition. Blue whales are migrating in from the north. First ones will appear near Skellige next week. If you know how to wield a harpoon, aren't afraid of storms, and want to embark on a true adventure, talk to Hagland. Contract. Dragon. Listen, careful folks. A dragon to the top of all dragons. A terror straight from the Skilla, uh, Skald's tales has infested the lands about Ferrisdal. It's 50 foot long, a hundred foot tall and can incinerate a man with fire from a hundred spans off or maybe even more. It's hard to say exactly for no one's been near anywhere been anywhere near that close to that creature and escaped with his life. Yet I faith that there's a son of Skellige brave enough to defend us from the evil by slaying the dragon. In exchange he'll get more than just a reward. He'll have the right to take the gold witch. As every fool knows, those fo foul beasts guard with their in their lairs. Vagn village, uh, village elder. Alright. I'm pretty sure that I don't... I'm pretty sure that I won't be able to... I thought I beat these guys. Oh no, I was level two. Okay, I need level twenty-three. Dangerous game. Mysterious track. Search the forest using your Velen. I may actually go back to Velen and see if I can scrounge up some more uh, 
some more points. amazing I'm not even done half the game and look at all these quests that I've actually completed I failed like a few actually only three but I did all the other ones except to talk to Cleaver I don't know why I failed that one but anyways all right I think that's it for me it's been two hours and my voice is starting to go I'm gonna save So, it was another evening of not doing too much advancement in the game, but um, at least I managed to get some experience. I didn't really get much done, but eh, not bad for a first night back after a week off. Um, yeah, so thanks to whoever passed by, Real Life Dinosaur, thank you as always, Overrider, The Great Champino, Psychosis, Angry Gorilla, Mr. Garf 1988, Engineering Gaming Nerd, and Real Life Dinosaur, thank you so much for hosting me it's greatly appreciated um, if you guys want to read my reviews you can go to corporategamer.net where I review video games on a weekly basis this week I review bases loaded on the NES um, and you can find me on Instagram twi Twitter um, every all the information is in my channel right below um, and I'm hoping that I'll be able to stream again tomorrow night so um, Hope that everyone has a wonderful evening. Oh, no problem. Thanks for your life. I appreciate for you passing by. Really appreciate it. Um, I'm sorry I didn't really get much done in terms of advancing in the story. Um, I was hoping to get a little bit more done, but you kind of have to grind a little bit to get the leveling up. Uh, so I'm, the next stream is probably going to be the same thing. So, um, Yeah, so thanks, thanks to everyone that passed by in and out and i hope that you guys have a wonderful evening and you should probably see me tomorrow night all right guys have a good one ciao